What's up guys? Raina here, voice and ukulele coach on Take Lessons. Today, we're gonna be talking about how to riff. So let's do this. The first thing that we need to do is define what a riff is. A riff is a short melody that's repeated over and over again throughout a song. Some popular riffs that you might recognize would be, I can't get no satisfaction from the Rolling Stones. Bum, ba, 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 ba. It's super catchy and it just repeats over and over and over. So how do you get good at riffing and how can you take those riffs and turn them into super awesome runs that are all your own? Well, to answer that, you just have to worry about getting from point A to point B. So to start, you're just gonna pick a riff that you really enjoy and just do it over and over again. So let's take that Rolling Stones riff. Da, 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 da. You're gonna do it enough times until it's in your head and you don't have to think about it anymore. So I'm gonna do it two more times just so that you don't have to think about it anymore. Here we go. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. The next thing you wanna do is change it up a little bit once you have a clear idea of what it is. So maybe we make it slower. Da, 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 da. Instantly that riff sounds completely different. What about if we sped it up? How we approach the riff is going to completely change the way that riff sounds. Once you decide how you want to sing the riff, now you can take it a step farther and you can work on runs within that riff and around that riff. So maybe I take my original riff, I slow it down. Da, 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 da. I add some volume, some dynamic to it. Maybe we'll start quiet, we'll get loud, and then we'll get quiet again. So, da, 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 da. And then maybe I decide I want to elongate some of those notes so that they sound slightly different. Not so different that I can't recognize the original riff, but different enough that it feels like, ooh, they own that riff. They've made that riff their own, right? So maybe I go, da, 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 and now I've taken that riff, I've created my own variation on that, and now I'm actually starting to include some runs into that. And that's pretty much it in a nutshell. Thank you so much for joining me today on how to riff. Be sure to find some riffs that you enjoy, have fun with them, make them your own, and then personalize them. Don't be afraid to get crazy and don't be afraid to mess up because sometimes some of the coolest art that you create is going to happen within those mistakes. Be sure to check out some of the other videos that we have available. Check out Take Lessons Live and I'll see you online soon.